This time on DDG Unleashed Season X, can Dave finally beat Elden Ring and complete his rite of passage, cementing himself as the greatest gamer of all time? Yeah, no. Probably not. Find out now on this new episode of Double Dragon Z! When you want to challenge in your video games, there may not be anything more challenging than Souls-style games. Elden Ring, Dark Souls, Sekiro, Shadows Die Twice. These games will humble you quick and make you question why you started gaming in the first place. In this video, I'm going to attempt to finish Elden Ring. Now, I've been dreading doing this for days, weeks actually, because while I've made it quite far in the game, I don't know if I can actually finish this shit. So yeah, I've been putting this off because I am dreading this. Now I love a challenge in my games and I've always prided myself on how good I am at video games, although now that I'm way older I feel like my skills have definitely diminished. I'm not as sharp or as fast or as, you know, intuitive, my reflexes are slower. I'm just not what I once was in my 20s, that's for sure. Now that I'm in my 40s, it's just, I'm nowhere near as good as I used to be, but I digress. In this video, I'm going to attempt to finish Elden Ring. Now, you may say, oh man, a let's play, come on. This isn't a let's play, this video has purpose, and I'm going to edit down, of course, to the best moments in the video here uh, from my gameplay. You know how I do, man. I don't slack off with this shit. I'm gonna do my best to make this video as good as possible. And I feel like it's time for something more entertaining from what I've been doing. So hopefully you guys enjoy this. And this is gonna take place over days and possibly weeks. I don't know if I can do this. The goal is obviously to finish Elden Ring, but there's a good chance that I'm not gonna be able to do it. So we'll see. I'm gonna give it my best and uh, we'll see if I can finish this. Now, obviously, Elden Ring Shadow of the Erd Tree came out about a month ago now, a month and a half ago, whatever it's been, and, you know, I wanted to finish Elden Ring in time for that, but, um, you know, I didn't get a chance to, and hopefully if I can finish this, then I'll give myself permission to get Elden Ring Shadow of the Erd Tree, and maybe we'll try doing a video for that, but uh, we'll talk about that later. Anyway, I always take way too much time with this nonsense, so uh, let's jump into the actual gameplay part, and let's see what I can do, and I'll explain more about what's going on as I continue on. So let's do it guys. Let's let's give it a shot. Okay, here we go. So about to fire up Elden Ring. This is day one of my attempt at finishing Elden Ring. And uh, to bring you guys up to speed now as to what's going on for my my playthrough. I've been I've been playing Elden Ring pretty much since the game first came out, about a month after it came out I think, on and off. Over 100 hours now. I'm not sure exactly how many hours I've played, um, but it's, def it's definitely over 100 hours. And I like to, when I really enjoy a game like I'm enjoying Elden Ring, I like to drag things out and take my time with it. So I, I probably should have finished the game by now, but I, I just really enjoy the game. So when I enjoy a game like this, I, I take my time with it. So, um, and I haven't, I haven't been like looking at tutorials too much, like try to figure out like the best way to build your character and and all that so let me show you what I got going on here with this shit now uh, if we take a look at my status here as you can see the way I've assigned my attribute points is a bit idiotic <laughs> um yeah anybody that really is a good player at this game and knows a lot about Elden Ring will immediately see that the way I've got my attribute points um, distributed is pretty stupid all right uh, I know that um, uh, yeah, I've just kind of been doing things, kind of just feeling shit out, just figuring this shit out on my own, and I wanted my character to be able to use magic a little bit, you know, I, I just, I don't know, I, I love magic and being able to use magic and spells and stuff like that, and for me to just put everything into strength and make him like a pure warrior, I just, I just couldn't do that, so putting some attribute points into the other areas, faith and arcane and shit like that, allows me to use magic but none of it is extremely powerful so at this point in the game now later part in the game it starts becoming really um less and less useful 
But nevertheless, that's what I did. So, yeah, I know my attribute points and everything is not great. Uh, level 156. So, again, I'm, I'm quite high as far as my level goes and my strength. But, um, you know, I've been taking my time with the game. Anyway, uh, yeah. let's Oh, well, let's do this. Let's take a look at my map. So, I believe I've unlocked everything. Uh, I'm not sure, but I've, I've pretty much uncovered the entire map here now i don't think i've ventured into every every place that you can go so um yeah i'm not sure i'm sure there's some stuff that i might be missing some areas i didn't go like i heard that there's an area down here like there's like a secret place down here that you can go not sure but uh yeah so again haven't really been using too many tutorials and shit like that most of the boss fights that i have uh done I just fought them over and over until I could beat them. Like the Tree Sentinel and uh, I believe the first time I needed help with like a, a walkthrough video or a tutorial video was the Fire Giant. So I beat his ass. I believe it's the Fire Giant, right? That's what you call him. Like you fight him in and around over here. Like right around here, I believe. So that was when I f the first fight that I really needed help. And started using like these walkthrough tutorial, you know, how to beat bosses and shit on, on YouTube. Uh, and then there was like a fight after that, another boss after that. I don't know. But where I am up to now is the Godskin duo. So these two motherfuckers are tough. And uh, that's what I'm on to next. So I'm not great at playing the game and talking at the same time. I just, I, I can't focus on speaking and playing. So, you know, a lot of this is just going to be me keep my mouth shut and give it my best so um i'm gonna have to be cheesy too with this shit you know i'm gonna have to uh unfortunately when it comes to like this fight with the godskin duo uh i tried doing it a few times like legit and you know just fighting him legit and i don't think it's gonna happen that way i'm gonna have to cheese it i believe so i've been watching a, a how-to video on how to beat the godskin duo holy shit whoa what what the fuck? Where did you come from? Oh shit, I don't even have I have the right weapon set up. Out of nowhere I'm being attacked here. And I don't have the right weapon for this. I'm not even warmed up. I I'm ice cold. Oh shit. Kind of cool that this guy came over here and fought me. Die! Is he still alive? He is. Okay, so that just happened. Scared the shit out of me, man. Ashes of War barricade shield. All right, cool. Nice, nice. All right, so we're off and running here with uh, being randomly attacked by an enemy that I didn't expect. I'm trying to explain like what I got going on here, and almost fucking got killed. So I'm gonna get mad. Um, I'm gonna get this game has pissed me off like you would not believe, man. But uh, I'm sure a lot of you that play this game and know this game understand that. So um, yeah, not not a big surprise there. All right, I I can't even remember where the Godskin duo is is it over here yeah i believe so so i'm in the final area of the game and i'm not sure how far along i gotta go before i can uh wrap this shit up so it's a mystery to me i'm not so i'm not sure how close i am to finishing the game i believe there's still a little ways to go i'm not sure this this may not take very long or it may i don't know but there are there are some really beautiful areas in this game. Some really good looking locations, man. Look at this. This game is incredible, man. I mean, come on. Look at this shit. I got so much to say about Elden Ring, but uh, we got we got shit to do here. But look at this, man. Look at this. Fucking fantastic. Fantastic. And my, my cape, what am I wearing? I'm gonna be hitting the long buttons a lot. 
Uh, Rodan's lion armor. I don't remember his keep ever being like so well defined. Like it is really, this isn't really the best place to, there we go. Look at how good his cape looks. I don't remember it looking like that. Was there like an update or something that made it look like that? I don't, I don't remember that. Eh, whatever. I haven't played this game in quite a while, so. Uh, I'm ice cold. It's gonna take some time to warm up. I'm taking way too much time on this shit. Let's get going. Let's see if I can find, this is not where I need to be. guys are maybe over here now I'm not even sure if you necessarily have to fight the godskin duo to progress I believe you do I think so wow I'm gonna be dying a whole lot I wish it kept track of how many deaths because boy oh boy <laughs> My death count would be quite high. I believe I'm in the right spot now for a Godskin duo. So I've watched a video on how to cheese them, and I'm going to I'm going to attempt to do it that way. I know it's pathetic to do it that way, but to get going to start, I'm just gonna do what I usually do, and that's my first few times. I'm just gonna I'm not even gonna try to beat them. I'm just gonna stay alive as long as possible and learn their attack patterns a little bit. That's what I generally do um, if big fights like this. It's been a while. I mean, I have fought them a few times before, but uh, it's been a while. This is it, right? All right, so as I said, I'm just going to... I'm not going to try to beat them. I just want to learn their attack patterns and shit. I'm just going to fuck around for a little bit here and uh, stay alive as long as I can. All right, so this is it, man. These two guys are... Up as nails. But I do have a lot of the shit that I need to beat them. So I've got my Mimic tier here. That's going to be important. And what I'm going to have to do is put this big guy to sleep. I know that. Let's see how well my Mimic tier... Um, my Mimic guy can survive. He's already get. Look at that. Look how fast. Look how much damage he's taken already. And he's already dead. Yeah, he's down. You, you got him. <sighs> yeah, so this is where the game starts getting really tough, man. I mean, it's a hard game through and through, and there are some tough boss fights, but this, this one in particular I know is very difficult. Um, also, Melina, or Melenia, however you say her name, she is very, very tough as well. And there are certain ways that you got to take these, uh, these enemies on. And I'm just fucking around here. I just want to see... I got the wrong sword on. I really trying to do this. But I got all the shit that I need. I got sleep arrows, sleep pots, I got my mimic tier, and I've got this, uh... Ice... Ice ability is... Oops, I got the wrong fucking sword on, so I can't even do it. The goal for today is just beat these guys. If I can complete, you know, beating the Godskin duo, I'll be happy with that. Okay, we're down. Alright, I think that that's good now for a little uh, dry run. Alright, I'm gonna check out this video again. And I'll be back. Alright, I've watched my video. I think I know the plan. And I've got my my sleep arrows set up. Equipped and everything. And uh Alright, man, I am just I'm so stressed about this. This should not be hard. But the problem is that if I if I keep failing, I'm gonna run out of arrows. And then I gotta try and go get more. So the only pressure that I'm feeling right now is that if I don't beat them on the first few attempts. I'm running out of arrows, and then I gotta try and use sleep pots, and I don't know how to use those. Ugh. Alright. I can do this. This is not hard. This should be easy. I'm gonna cheese them. I'm gonna use the Harfrost Stomp. We can do this. Got my Mimic guy, my Mimic tier. Let's get over there. Let's do this. Wish me luck. 
Whoops, that's not the way to go. Alright, this is attempt number one. They're fighting and beating the Godskin duo. Oh my god. Please. Please, God! Holy shit! What the fuck? No. I've already taken damage. Look at this. Yeah, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna try doing this right now. Uh, that's not the way to start this. Look at this. Look how fast I can die. Look how easy. <laughs> I walk in. I summon my Mimic Tear. That didn't happen in the video. I mean, I got hit immediately. Fuck. This is not gonna be good. I don't want to waste my arrows. And I don't want to start off like that. That's not the way to start this. Fuck, man. Come on. Why does this game gotta be so hard? Come on, goddamn. I know the, uh... The trick is not to roll. Like, you're supposed to, like, jump. That, like, rolling is not the way to do it in this game. I know that. I've seen that many times. That instead of, you know, doing this, don't do that. You can jump and jump through their attacks. And I know. But I just hammered the fucking B button, man. In the video, he walks in the room, he throws on Mimic Tear, and he doesn't get hit straight away. Here we go. Wait, I already have... Oh, it cost me a life to summon him? One. Three. Three. Oh, my guy's already dead! This is not good, man. No. Supposed to hit him through the pillar. I knew it was going to be hard. I knew it. The guy's going to wake up now. Oh, shit. This is bullshit. No fucking way, man. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. This is not fair. Here he comes. Oh, and I'm out of... Mm. Yep. Holy shit. Yep, yep. Pro gamer my ass. Pro gamer my fucking ass that I am. Nope, not gonna happen on this attempt. Not gonna happen on any attempt. Oh man, I don't know 
if I can do this. He's down. Can't even cheese him. Oh shit. Not my last flask. So in that video that I watched, the guy walks in the room, he throws on Mimic Tear, he's able to uh, kill the other guy before the uh, fat man wakes up, and my Mimic Tear guy is just dying way too fast. Oh, man. And now I have seven arrows left. I can only do this two more times with the arrows, and then I gotta go find more. That guy is fucking following me. No, come on, what are you doing? Nope, I woke him up, didn't I? Yep. Well, this, this run is now officially fucking... I'm panicking. I have to remain calm. If I panic and I get all upset, I'm gonna fuck up. I have to remain calm. <laughs> Wake up the big guy. What the fuck? He hit me through the... Why are you awake? Oh my god. I didn't hit him. He must have got hit. Yeah, this works real well. This this works real well. Just cheese him. It's easy. As usual, my first attempt was the best attempt. I, this is why I was so scared to do this, because I knew I only have three shots, and I, and I blew it. Now I don't have enough arrows. I only got one left. And I bet you there's not even an infinite amount that you can't- I can't just keep going and getting them. Okay. So I just watched this video on how to use sleep pots to uh, beat the Godskin duo, and the guy, it like, took no effort. Like, he did it so fast and so easy, he was using, like, these two claws and shit. Yeah, okay, dude. Great. Wonderful. I'm gonna try, uh, use the sleep pots now. I got plenty of those. Remain calm. Just remain calm. Calm is the way to do it. And he hit me again. He hit me again as I'm walking into the room. Uh, yep, look at this. I, I can't even... Hit him! Did I put him to sleep? He's asleep.
Fight me. Fight me. Leave my mimic guy alone. I'm starting off the battle by getting hit through the fucking summoning wall. Yep. Yep. I'm not fucking around anymore. Using sleep pots. <laughs> My mimic guy's using sleep pots. <laughs> oh, yeah. This is why I didn't want to do this, man. Like, oh, I'm so, I'm such a professional fucking gamer. I'm so good, man. You suck. I suck. I fucking suck ass. This shit. I walk in the room and I throw a sleep pot when I want to use a mimic tier. This is why you guys come to watch this shit for me to blunder it so bad. I mean, I've made it this far in the game, like, I'm, you know, I'm not terrible. I'm not terrible at this shit. I'm gonna give it a go. The Hall Frost Dump. Yeah, yeah, you didn't get me that time, you idiot. No. Get away from him. And he's awake. Just doesn't do enough damage. Fuck it, I'm just gonna hit him both. You're not supposed to be able to hit me through the pillars! Mimic to a guy dies in like two seconds. Use a strong summon. Use the mimic tier. I can't target him through the pillar. I'm at a loss for words, man. You watch these videos and it makes it look so easy. I can't believe this shit. I, that's the best I could do, man. I got him... I got them both down to like halfway. That Hall Frost Stomp is not doing enough damage. And I don't know if it's because my weapon is not leveled high enough. It's uh, plus 15 right now. And, you know, my Mimic Tier guy doesn't survive long enough. And he's accidentally hitting the fat man and waking him back up. He's dying too fast. I've got two sleep pots left. I wasted two by accidentally throwing them, thinking I had Mimic Tier on. This is going so horribly wrong. So horribly wrong, dude. I felt... Like, maybe I had a shot in that last attempt. I'm out of arrows. I got two sleep pots left. This isn't- this isn't gonna happen right now. 
this this isn't gonna this isn't gonna work. Um, I'm gonna try with my last two sleep pots, but uh, yeah, yeah. This this could be the video, guys. This this actually is probably it. Like, can I beat Elden Ring? Can I finally finish Elden Ring? And I can't even get past these two motherfuckers. This is supposed to be a cool video, but I I this is why I didn't want to do the video because I knew this was gonna happen. Like I just knew it. I fucking knew it, dude. Yeah, sure. So, you know, that's it. Like, I was so enthusiastic at the beginning, right? I was so, like, like my demeanor was totally, completely different than what it is now. Now I'm just fucking frazzled. I'm fucking, I'm, my mind is just blown. Like, I didn't anticipate my Mimic Tier guy hitting the big guy and waking him up. Like, none of that shit crossed my mind. And... I can't believe I wasted, I just wasted all the shit that I had. This fight is not supposed to be this hard when you cheat. So, that's going to do it for, for this attempt, and maybe I try again. Who the fuck knows, who the fuck cares. Fuck this shit. Alright. Fuck it. Fuck it, man. I wanted to try to keep the video like down to half an hour, hour max. And every time I have a goal in mind of how long I want the video to run for, I just can't seem to do it. So you know what? Fuck it, man. I'm, I'm, tr I'm done trying to like shoot for a goal and get there because I just can't seem to do it. So, you know, because I'm already editing the video from last night and shit and it's already at half an hour, even like edited down to, you know, as much as I could cut out. So, you know what? Screw it, man. This, this video may run three, four, five fucking hours long or longer and for those of you who are really enjoying it and want to like marathon the whole thing like go for it i hope you'll do that but some of you like maybe it, just have to watch it in small increments you know you watch it a bit you know turn it off go do something else maybe come back later watch it some some more and then just do it bit by bit because it may run really long so right now i'm trying to get s some more sleep pots and i'm entering some areas that i haven't like explored before and so i figured what the fuck i'm just gonna I'm going to include some of this as well for some of my viewers that maybe you never played the game or don't know much about it. For people who haven't really seen much of Elden Ring, this will be like a good way to like show off some more of the locations and stuff and some other shit as I try to collect some more sleep pots for this next endeavor. So, yep, let's uh, let's do that. Enough talking, enough bullshit. All right, so trying to find some sleep pots. I'm looking at this walk through this tutorial. All cracked pot locations super fast. Yeah, right. Yeah, cracked pots are really hard to come by in this shit. I thought I, like, I really cleared the map good. And there's still some places I haven't been to. Like, over here. There's still some area over here that, like, I gotta go go get. So, I'm doing that. And, uh, look how cool this freaking tree looks, man. Fucking awesome. This game is just so great, man. It's just, it's so beautiful. The map is so freaking huge, dude. Like, there's just so much to do. There's so many places to go. So many hidden areas. This game is a gem. For those people who think, like, this isn't the best, like, Dark Souls type game. I don't know. Like, I played some of the others. Dark Souls Remastered and shit a bit. Never really got into them. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong, but I think this game is just way, way more special than all the others. Uh, so, yeah. Really cool area over here, you know. Anyway, and I get lost, like a lot of people do. I'm sure we get lost in this huge map, man. It's just massive, and you go one way and find out you've gone a completely wrong way. You're up way high when you need to be way down low. So I went all the way up. Uh, all the way up there, like, oh, I can't even pull up the map now. Yeah, went all the way up there to find out, like, I gotta, I gotta come back down here. This fucking 
game. Just so great, man. Just the aesthetic, like, the designs of all the characters and shit. It's just like it's got its own vibe, man. It's just so great, you know? Anyway, yeah, I went all the way up here. And I'm like, oh, can't fucking go there. So I gotta come all the way back down here now. Just trying to get some crack pots so I can put that fat bastard to sleep. I already got a few. I was playing a little bit before and then decided, you know what, I'm playing. Uh, I might as well just, you know, record this shit in case something interesting happens. Or I get invaded or, you know. Who knows what could happen, man. What do you think about this dumbass webcam circle thing that I'm using? This is like the only thing I could get real quick. Most of the time you gotta like buy this shit or it's like really hard to get these transparent PNGs. And it's not just the circle. It's got like this like, like grainy like shit over it. Like so like I don't look really clear. I could just do it like this. I could do it like this. Is this better? I don't know. You don't need to really see me, right? I'm too big. Lock it in. Alright. Cool, cool. My girlfriend's got me doing that now. Cool, cool. She says that shit all the time. Ah, gotta, gotta mention my sweets, you know? Always gotta mention her in my videos. Otherwise she gets upset. And it's just like... A thing now. We've made it like a... A theme. No! See? See how stupid I am? See the dumb shit I do? I almost fell in. Shit. A lot of the time you can just run past enemies. And that's fine. That's good. Let's fight one. Hell yeah. Because my sword is like mad strong. Plus 10. One of the like special weapons. I've been using Sword of Night and Flame pretty much for the whole the whole game. But I got a lot of other shit too. This isn't the only thing I got. That's what I've been spending all my time doing in this game, like getting all kinds of different shit. Not not a ton of shit. Um But yeah, I wanted some I wanted some options. I wanted some choices. So we got Guts's Great sword from Berserk. Freaking cool. Uh, some other shit here. Got some whips. You know, I don't know what the hell this does. Well, actually, I don't know what it does. Got this really sick dragon claw shield that you get from Tree Sentinel, I believe. I believe. And let's, um, you know what? Do a different outfit. What do you think? There we go. Got something different going on. Is this boring? Am I boring you? I'm sorry. Let's go. Come on, we got shit to do. No. Yeah, I mean, I, uh, <laughs> I'm gonna need to watch a tutorial for this shit. Uh huh. Yeah. How do you get up there? I don't know. I, I really don't know. I'm sure someone's watching that knows how you get up there. It's, you gotta hit that thing to bring the spiral staircase down, right? What else could I possibly use to... You can't target it. That is weird. I've never seen anything like this before. Never. That is something that you would stand on. Ordinarily, you'd stand on it. What do I have to, like, flip the room upside down? What is this shit? What is this shit, man? I can't open my map. Bro, I hate this fucking game. Oh, my God. And there's so many things about this game that drive me fucking nuts. Why can't I open my map? Like, why? Why? Just because there are enemies around and I'm still engaged in them? I can't open my map? Get the fuck out of here. I'm ready to just jump off the side and start over. I can't- I don't even know where I am to Google, like, what to do. This is a joke. 
This isn't even where I'm trying to go. Nice time that was. Maybe I'll just cut that part out of the video. Maybe a few quick shots of that and then... Nope, we don't go this way either. What the fuck, man? Oh my god, dude. Yo, in the, vi the video I'm watching... And I'm not even kidding. I wish I could show this. You know what? I'm gonna show it. It, like, goes... There's no gap here. You see what I'm talking about? It just can, it keeps going. It connects. How old is this video? From two years ago. D does that look like it's connecting to you? Am I not seeing this right? Is this something totally different? What is... Am I in the wrong spot? Why does this game have to do this to me now? Every time I try to make a video, things always go wrong. This reminds me of when I used to, like, try to get, like, groups of people to hang out and, like, like go and do, some, like, go and do something as a group of friends. Things would always go wrong. I could never, like, throw a party or, or have, like, a whole bunch of friends, like, do something. It was always a fucking disaster. Yeah, that I don't understand, and I need to get here. So we got to figure this out. This is, this is unbelievable. It's literally completely different in my map. It's not the same thing. We'll be back after these messages. We're experiencing, uh, here, how about this? Whoopsie doodles. Double Dragon Gaming is experiencing technical difficulties. We'll be right back. All right. According to this other video that I'm watching, I'm going to go a different way. A way different way here. And that way appears to be this way. We're going to do some uh, spelunking. I guess? No, that's cave diving. This is gonna be great, guys. Guys, guys, this is gonna be so great. <laughs> this is gonna be so great, guys. Oh, wow. Let's watch. Ready? Let's see. Here we go. This must mean something. What the fuck? Where is it? You gotta be shitting me. Here it is. Here we go. Hey, okay, ready? Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Look at all these blood stains. Let's watch this guy fuck it up. There he goes. Bye. What about you? How'd you do? He made it. Fucking idiot. <laughs> Let's see. I'm going to do the same thing. And... Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh no. Jarberg. Fucking stupid name. I didn't watch the rest of the video. I just watched this. It's got to be this house, right? Boom. Boom. Fucking professional. Professional. That's right, folks. What the you fuck? My heart. Please don't crack the others. Oh, all right. If you, oh shit. If you give me a cracked pot, I'll leave him alone. All right. Yeah. I just, I still just can't get over this, how this game looks, man. Just look at this shit. It's so great, man. Man. Oh, man. All right. Ugh. Okay. I gotta watch, uh, I watch this fucking video now. All right, guys. This is awesome. I'm gonna get, like, three cracked pots right now. So... Check this out. One. Uh, 
a ritual pot. Oh, when I want to do ritual shit, you know. Let's see if I can get stuck in a wall. What else? Oh, a lot of stuff to collect here. Harvesting some plants and fruit and shit. My short term memory is not very good. I already forgot. Like, he gets three crack pots. That's two. There's one in here. Bam. And that's three. I think that's all that there is to get over here. And these guys, it'd be great if these guys drop pots, but I don't think they do. It's one of the things that really I was kind of disappointed with in Elden Ring is like anything that you can break like nothing ever drops from it so like you can break shit like that and you can break shit like these pots and there's nothing ever hidden in them so it's a lot of destructible shit but there's no reason to destroy it so it's one of my gripes with Elden Ring but you know, no, no game is perfect right anyway we did what we came to do so that's great I should accomplish. There's still more I can do here. I can try to get up here and go over this fucking place. I'll mark this so that I know, like... I wish it was, like, a question mark marker. What have I been using to represent places I haven't gone? I think this? I don't know. Whatever. On to the next one. So many shrines I've still yet to uncover. So we've got one over here that I haven't visited yet. Hundred hours, hundred and three of fucking around and I still haven't gotten all the shit that you can get. And that's what you want in a game like this. That's what you want. Look at this. Oh my god, I have to, I have to hit, I have to hit these guys. I just have to do it. When you got this many enemies. Oh my god. Hold on. Let's do this. Wind up. No, that didn't work. Wrong button. This drives my friend my friend Chris crazy in Diablo. I just have to... Any enemies I see, I gotta kill them. I just have to do it. Precarious. All right. Great. Let's take a look. Let's check it out. Well, let's just go to item crap. Oh, look at that. Oh, shit. Look at this. I can make 17 sleep pots. Fucking A, dude. Why am I able to make so many now? Oh, okay. I got 17 crack. What the fuck? I'm confused. Huh? Why? This game confuses me. Because before, when I was making sleep pots, it was. I would lose my cracked pots. Was I doing something wrong? Now I keep my cracked pots, but I lost my Trina's lilies. <laughs> However, I just got 17 sleep pots. Yes. I'm going to waste all 17 sleep pots, guys. I'm going to waste them all. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to waste all these sleep pots. Like, 37 fucking years of my life. I, like, make this, like, my main thing in life. Like, this is my thing. This is what I do. I, I play video games. I'm a gamer. I take this shit very seriously. Like, it's my fucking job. I don't get fucking paid for it. Yeah. Can I beat Elden Ring? Can I just beat the Godskin duo? Well... We'll find out tomorrow. I think this is enough for today. We're going to find out tomorrow. 
I'll probably shut this fucking shit off and just take some trial runs or whatever. Um, but we're going to come up with a strat, and I'm going to figure this shit out, and then we're going to move on to the next thing, and then we're going to move on to the next thing, and the next thing, and the next thing, and we'll see. We'll see. Maybe you'll watch for five hours, and I won't beat the game. Maybe you'll watch for five hours, and I won't beat the Godskin duo. Maybe you won't watch at all, and I'm wasting my fucking time. Whatever. Whatever. I'm having a good time, so. All right. Tomorrow it is. Uh, night number three. See you then. This is it. This is definitely it. My Mimic Tears plus 10. I've got 17 sleep pots. I'm feeling strong. Let's fucking go, bitches. I beat them. I fucking did it, man. And they still killed me. Unbelievable. I have never... <laughs> I've never had that happen in a fight. I have never beat the enemy to have him kill me after he's been beaten. Because, of course, there's two of them. So the other motherfucker got some last shots in. That was so freaking weird. I... I can't even, like, get really excited and happy about that victory because I died. Oh, my God. After all that work, after everything I did uh, to win and still lose. Oh, my God. Oh, this fucking game. This game. Oh, this fucking game, dude. you got to be kidding me. Whatever. Whatever, man. I got you. I got you. I did it. It's done. The area is cleared. What the fuck? Oh. Oh, man. Holy fuck, dude. Jesus Christ. They fucking, they fucking killed me. I killed them, and they still got me. I'm still, oh, God. Uh, that's going to take a while. It's going to take a minute for me to digest that. Um, but we did it. We, we freaking did it, man. I killed the Godskin duo. I was able to do it by uh, upgrading my Mimic tier to plus 10. I didn't realize that you can do that with summons. You can actually upgrade them. There's a lot I don't know about this game. And, uh, yeah. So, that's that's pretty much how, how I did it. I just upgraded my Mimic tier to plus 10. And he was able to take a lot more damage and do a lot more damage. And that really helped me in the fight. I don't even know what to do now. I don't know what comes after this. So we're going to find out together. So let's see. Let's see, man. Fuck. This game is a, it's a doozy. I'll tell you. We cleared the area. We got their asses. I don't know what I got from that. Um, I didn't really... I'll have to check the video again. But I think I got to go this way now. We don't need this fucking weapon anymore. Let me use, uh... Let me go with my trusty Sword of Night and Flame. What we got here? Thank you! Well done. Thank you very much. Two well dones. Yeah, that was, uh... Wow.
Nice. Really nice. Great. We're, f <laughs> We're moving on. We're finally moving on. I'm afraid to do anything. I'm afraid to move on. I'm afraid to keep going. I'm scared. I'm freaking scared, man. I'm just gonna take my time. Oh, God. It's hot down here. It's really hot down here. Um, alright. Fucking throw shit at me. Damn it. As you can tell, as you can see, I suck at this game. I just... I No excuses. There's just no excuse. I just suck at it. Uh, I mean, I am a little... A little rusty. But... Still. This is just... Bad. Bad gameplay. I got no excuses. Oh, I was able to walk down? Or no? Oh, look at that. I came over here. And I looked, and I... <laughs> Jesus. I don't know if this next boss fight is it. This could be it. I don't know if there's any more after that. So. This could be the last fight coming up. I'm not sure. Jumping. Oh, jumping. If only I had a horse. Hello, friends. I don't know if these white ghosts are people that just recently came through here. I don't know. Which, that would be cool if it, if that's what it, what it is. Uh, I love watching the uh, failed attempts. He's thinking about it. <laughs> oh man, look at this. This is something that I would do. Totally. Whoops. Ah. Yeah. What would this guy do? Look at that shield. He's got a fucking... Gravestone as a shield. What happened? He just he just collapsed. One of those enemies must have got him. Oh wow. What do you think? You think that's it right there? I think so. That cathedral? This is it? Final battle? Last boss? Maybe we can be done with this shit and I can start making some other videos. Oh my god! Dude, that literally- that did scare me. Holy shit. Ooh. Get off! I almost knocked him off the edge. Oh my god, that guy scared the shit out of me, man. I should have seen it coming, too. I should have known. But I was looking at the guy that was dead on the floor like, Why is he dead? Did I come over here or something? Any pro Elden Ring players that are brave enough to watch this, or bored enough to watch this, must be, uh, like, ripping their hair out at how I'm playing this. You know? Hammering on the fucking roll. Just hammering on the fucking attack button. Whoops. Pressing the wrong buttons. That's one of my biggest problems in these later years of my life now is just, like, I just press the wrong buttons all the time. I, I don't know. Like, my concentration is shot, dude. I should probably retire, but I've got too much, way too many ways to play video games, computers, and handhelds, and I've invested so much time and money and my whole life into it. Like, I, I actually can't, like, Stop playing, like. Oh god. You know what I really wanted to use? I don't think I can, uh... Hmm. Let's see. The Comet Azure spell. 
This Kamehameha wave shit. I wanted to use this for that battle against the Godskin duo. Fucking sick, man. Sick attack. Pretty cheap, too. But, uh, you need 60 intelligence, and I only have 30. I could, theoretically, I believe, just keep leveling and just keep going until I get enough, but that would take fucking eternity. I don't know if there's a cap to your leveling. I don't know. There might be, but I don't know. It feels like there isn't. They took away all the quick rune farming spots. Like, um, they patched the game, and one of my go-to spots to farm runes, you jump off the map, and you keep swinging your weapon, and it gives you, like, mad runes. I forget how many, like, 125,000, 150,000. They patched all the shit, so, like, none of those areas work anymore. So, when I was trying to level up my Mimic tier, I needed runes. I'm like, oh, I'll just go to my old spot and, you know, nice and easy, you know, get some runes. Nope, can't do that. So now you gotta do it the old school way and, like, shoot that bird. I'll show you the spot. That's what I'm talking about. So you can go to, like, a secondary part of the map. Like, the lower level, I guess. Right over here. This is where I would do my, um, my rune farming in this area here. Of course, they patched the fucking game. And stop pressing B, dude. Oh my god. I'm gonna do that and accidentally fall off the freaking map. Idiot. We'll get there eventually, guys. We'll get there. Eventually. You know. Alright, so this is uncharted territory for me. I've never been over here, and I'm, I believe we're trying to go over here be the final battle and I would imagine so because um I mean this is it this is the end of the map you know you do have the section over here the Haleg tree Haleg tree is um Melina Melinia I can't say these names Melina is she over there I think she is Cheap. Ugh. Hell yeah. Ugh. Try these, mate. Heal. Pretty sick place, man. Got some smithing stones. Pretty cool as a final, uh, final location goes. Holy shit. I'm just taking my time, just moseying. I'm afraid of... I, I don't want to know what this next... Holy shit, we got an army coming. I'm too scared to, like, see what the next part is. That's not what I want to do. Oh, that's right, I can't use my greatsword ability. Oh, fuck. I got to I got to stop dicking around here. Uh, I'm I'm just dicking around too much. We got to get serious, all right? Golden Lightning Fortification. Oh shit. We got a dragon. Sweet. Should we fight the dragon? Um. Yeah, we gotta fight the dragon, right? Alright. Let's, uh. 
<laughs> Let's try to fight this dragon. I got a mimic too I can use. All right. No, that's a sleep pot. I just wasted a sleep pot. I don't even know how much life he's got. Oh. Stop doing that! Shit! I have my shield up. Oh shit. Oh, I could do this if I could just heal myself. Okay, great! Come on! Come on! Stop targeting! Finish him! And now I'm just... Oh my god! Look at how pathetic. Oh my god, man. I am embarrassed. I am embarrassed with how bad I'm playing. I am playing so trashy. Jesus Christ. I feel like... Like, this is... Like, I should just play nothing but, like, Souls games until I get good at them. Like, I should just live and breathe Elden Ring. Because this is this is beyond pathetic. This is just so bad. I'm hitting the wrong buttons. I'm jumping and flailing around like a fucking asshole. I can't target shit the way I want to target it. That was just so fucking pathetic, man. But as, for, as bad as I'm playing, as bad as it is, I'm still here, man. Like, I'm, I'm still here, dude. I made it all this way. It may not be pretty, but we're getting it done. And I just beat that dragon. In the worst way possible. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Alright. This is it, man. This is the way. This is holy shit! Not again. No. <laughs> oh, he's got something under him. We'll, uh... Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, man. You have to wake him up. Oh, shit. I mean, I did it before, right? I can beat him again. Maybe this time do it, like... Like, skillfully, like... Yeah. This time we're gonna... Nah. Uh, get the thing!
No, thank you. You stay over there, buddy. Look at him. He's mad. Oh, shit. Will it reach? Woo! This game is no joke. This game is no freaking joke. Look at that. Lots of smithing stones. Yeah. Yeah, you're a badass dragon. Rawr. Rawr. Wow, it's reaching all the way over here. That was not the way to go, man. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, shit. I can't get back now, can I? Oh, God. Ah. Look at this shit. These bastards! From soft, you bastard! You go over here, and then you're trapped. What did you get hit by? There's nobody over here. Well, this is some bullshit. This is some... Oh, well. Pretty good. Uh, I see. I see. They're saying use the side of grace. Right? Is that what that means? Is that what you're telling me? Why is it 76 degrees down here? It is fucking hot, dude. Holy shit. Okay, I think that's good for today. I beat the Godskin duo. Uh, I'm gonna call it here, and it's getting late. So, tomorrow we continue on with night four. And just, I don't know. Like, I feel kind of numb over what happened. Beating them, and they just, they got their last licks in, you know? Just one last fuck you. And pissing me off, dude. Killing me like that. God. Ah. Alright, we still got w more work to do. We'll see what happens, uh... The rest of this shit. It, it, no one's probably watching this far, but whatever. Alright, what are we on? Night four now? Yeah, I think it's night four. Day four. We're going on night four. Wow. Just wow. From the very first day I started playing this game, up until now, this has been one of the best experiences I've ever had playing a game. And I may actually have to put this in my top five best games of all time. Um, out of all the games I've ever played, this may, this may be in the top five. So, uh, yeah, it's been, it's been something. This whole experience, well before I started filming this video. So many highs, so many lows, so many aggravating moments, so many glorious victories. Where we get so excited and so happy after beating a boss. But, um, you know, this video has been running pretty long. We've been doing this for a bit. So uh, let's take a quick break. Let me go outside and um, just speak on some of the things I wanted to say about this game. And then uh, we'll get back to it. Nothing nothing crazy. But um, I, feel, I feel like it's time to switch up the uh, scenery real quick from the doldrums of my basement and uh, sprighten things up. So, yeah, I, I think it's time for a break. So Elden Ring is an amazing game. It's fantastic, we know it's great, but it could also be a very, very hard game. Or not, it can be a very hard game or a very easy game, depending on how you wanna play it. It's, it's really up to you. And I have made it very hard on myself by 
you know, playing the game and then leaving and then coming back to it. And I tend to make the game a lot harder on myself than it needs to be, but it can be easy if you cheese bosses, if you use certain tactics and uh, certain, certain approaches on different enemies. It doesn't have to be that hard. And people say it's the easiest of all the Souls games. And it probably is. It probably is because of all the different shrines and the way that you don't have to play it in a certain way. It's not linear, it's more open, so you can go wherever you want and do things in whatever order that you want to do it. So, you know, they're, they're probably right in that regard. It's the easiest of all the Souls games. But for me, it's been a very hard, challenging, tough run. A very hard experience because I'm just playing it willy-nilly, you know, I'm not, I'm not really doing it in a, uh, not doing it by following tutorials or anything like that, you know, I'm using tutorials now to, to beat like the Godskin duo and, you know, some of the later bosses, but for a long time I was just playing it, you know, and uh, that's probably the best way to play this game is to just have fun with it and play it however you want to and only use guides and YouTube videos when absolutely necessary. You know, because that, that can ruin it. You know, cheesing bosses. I just saw something on Facebook, uh, how to cheese Milena, Milenia. Still don't know how to say her name. There's like a way to like trap her in the corner and then like you, like, like a fireball just keeps hitting her while she's stuck in the, in the corner and you can just cheese her to death. You know, in certain situations where you can't beat a boss and you get stuck, maybe that's the way to go. But that, that takes all the fun out of the game. So I might try to... Uh, fight this final boss legit, but it takes some serious skill. Like you really gotta be good at this game. You really gotta live and breathe this game. Just just play it a lot to get really good at it and to, to learn the fundamentals. But uh, yeah, it's been, a, it's been an interesting video, man. It's been, um, it's been a fun one to make, but it's going long. So we'll just see, we'll see how it goes. So anyway, that concludes this break. Let's get back to the gameplay. Yeah, 11 days, 11 days since I shot that last segment. I did not intend on taking damn near two weeks off um, from this project. I was going to, my intention was right after I filmed that segment, go downstairs and continue making this video, continue playing Elden Ring and beat this fucking game. Well, sure enough, uh, didn't happen. <clears throat> probably because of fucking Diablo 4, this fucking game is just, I don't know why I love it so much. I'm just playing it way too much. And between my love for the game and the new season and everything, um, just sapping all my time and my best friend plays the game and he wants to play with me and my girlfriend plays it now. She's back into it and she wants to play it with me. And I I'm not, I don't want you guys to feel <clears throat> bad or anything. I'm not blaming you. Um, I'm not saying that it's your fault or anything, uh, the two of you. I love playing the game with you guys, and that's why I've said fuck it with this video and just been spending all my time playing with you guys. So anyway, I it's been damn near two weeks now since I've even touched Elden Ring. And what does that mean? Well, that means that I am now going to be rusty once again. But um, <clears throat> the video goes on, and we continue on. So fuck it you know uh it is what it is this video is taking way too way too much time as you can see this is this is why even if i was a really successful youtuber and got all the views and was really popular i would never be able to hold it because i'm just all over the place and between my responsibilities to my family and work and just being tired all the time and other games to play and whatever um sure enough this video should have been done about a week ago, <laughs> probably at least five to six days ago, I would imagine. Um, that was my goal anyway. Anyway, we're going to continue on from where I left off and we'll see how this goes. We should be getting close now to the end. All right. So before we uh, really get going, you remember earlier in the video, if you've been watching the whole way and you didn't skip around, remember earlier how I was over here and uh, I went all the way up to the... Um, the rafters i guess and uh there was that big circular like stairwell that i couldn't reach well it turns out remember how i was saying um 
Like, do I have to flip the room upside down? No, that can't be it, right? No way. Not in a game like this. Well, sure enough, that is how you do it. And I believe it is done here. So we have to use some hourglass thing, which I believe I have. And I do. And this allows me to access that, uh, that stairway. Yeah, so I was getting all mad and shit and couldn't understand, like, what was, what was going on with that and how you could possibly access that stairway, that spiral staircase. This is how you do it. Mosquito in here. Fucking skeets. So now that whole area should be um, accessible. That whole room should be flipped upside down. And uh, let's just go check it out real quick. See what that looks like now. Or maybe, maybe we're not doing that. What the hell? Do I have to, uh... <laughs> uh, mm-hmm. Maybe I needed to bring this up before I did that? What a mystery. See, I only watched a little bit of this video that, that explained, like, how it was done, but I didn't actually watch, like... Really watch it? <laughs> yeah, the, this... Fuck, man. Never, nothing's ever easy. You can never just do, you know, what you want to do. So, well, we're going to have to remove it again. Very carefully remove it. All right. We flipped it again. And no. Uh, what the fuck? All right. Forget it. Never mind. Fucking ridiculous. We're not doing that. Stupid. Uh, okay. Alright, so I'm getting very close now. Um, I'm gonna have to go this way, I believe. I died over here, huh? I gotta take this pathway, this bridge here, and see what we can see. And this, this is probably going to be an ordeal now because I haven't played in a while, so. Oh boy, oh boy. <clears throat> wow. Oh boy. As end of games go, this is, uh, this is pretty cool. It's a final... I'm fighting these guys. Uh, last time I came through here, I remember he had almost no life. He had almost no health left. This uh, this dragon directly ahead of me. For whatever reason, I don't know why. I don't remember dying here. Holy 
shit. God damn it. Oh, yeah, look at that. So I don't know why he's almost dead. Um, it can't be that easy, right? No way. No way. These guys are a real pain in the ass. All right, whatever. Here we go. Let's see what happens. <laughs> All right. Yes. All right, that's great. <laughs> that's great, guys. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh, yeah. We just wanted to get that out of the way, you know, because I knew at some point, of course, at some point I'm going to do something stupid like that. So let's just get that out of the way. Just real quick, real early. Just be done with it. Now that won't happen again. Do you guys mind giving me a break and stop pecking at my head? Ah, oh, okay. Let's see. See if this is any any use. All right. No, no, no! I didn't want to do that. No, stop. See? Kind of useful. Ooh. Right on. All right. All right, here we go. Right, these are very hard to come by. That was really easy and stupid, and I don't understand what happened there. I don't know why. He was literally on his last legs. But I'm not going to question it. Uh, we got a break on that one. Maybe there's something I did um, throughout the game that does that. I don't know. Anybody who's watching, still watching at this point? and knows why he was pretty much dead, leave in the comments what that's all about. Hello, friend. Just gonna do a little exploring here. this oh yeah man all right that's great hell yeah dude I just stand behind this tree you won't see me it's like a werewolf dude oh no they do see me This guy. It's not a werewolf. <clears throat> oh. No. Ah. Well, look at this. Yeah. There he goes. He made it. Can I make it? 
Do I have to go that way? Probably. Yep. Looks like it. Alright, here we go. Oh, shit. Alright, what do we got here? Like a... Sub-boss? <laughs> this guy's like, fuck, no, no. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not fucking with him. Check the corners. This is just like what normal dude, right? Like, oh, what the fuck? Ah, oh, man. Oh, blown. Blew that opportunity. Just a normal dude. Oh my god. My sword, my special moves, whatever you want to call them, they take so long to do. Like, look at this. Uh, uh. By the time I get it out, it's just too late. Look at, look at how stupid I am. I just wanted to use that ability, but... No, 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 no! no. Just shaking the rust off. That's what this is right now. Just shaking the rust off. Damn, look at the range on this shit. Yes! Yes, 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 yes. I've been looking for this. Very good. Wanted that for a long time, but couldn't get it because fucking endgame. What surprise awaits me at the top? I'm all bloodied. Look at how much blood is on me. It's fucking great. Ah, thank you. Ah. Sight of Grace. Yeah, so as I was saying, you know, people people say that this is the easiest of the Souls games, and you know, they're right. They gotta be right, because you could approach the game however you want, and there's so many different places to, you know, save. All the save places, the, uh, the Sight of Graces, you know, really makes the game 
a hell of a lot easier, you know, than these other Souls games. Um, but yeah. Good to find a side of grace. And this, for anyone who doesn't play Elden Ring, doesn't know, I believe is a... Yeah, this is so uh, a friend could join or I can get some help and bring in another player, but, you know, we're not going to be doing that, most likely, unless I really get desperate. But it's pretty cool that you can do that. And here we are. Here we are. This is where I've been trying to get to. Which I... <laughs> I was all the way up there. All the way up there. Just dead ahead, right above my helmet. I was standing there like... How the fuck do I get over here? And I had to like... A mosquito, man. Really had to, uh... You know, give it thought. But obviously it's not that hard to figure out, right? You can only go one way, you know? This way. But... Yeah. Um... This fucking mosquito is driving me nuts. Let's, let's check out over here real quick. Fucking great, man. This game is just... Ugh. So amazing. Everything that you see, for the most part, any place that you see, you can... That's a place you can go. You know? Yeah. Like, over there, you can actually go there. And walk on that. On that roof. Yeah, I can hear him snoring. We're gonna leave them be. I don't see any reason to fuck with them right now. And... <clears throat> Well, let's, uh, let's make the game longer and make this video even longer than it needs to be by going off the beaten path. Oh. Oh, that would have been such a good... Oh, that would have been so cool to stab him in the back with that finishing move. Uh, so I was saying earlier that I really wanted to use that Kamehameha wave with that, um, that skill. Yeah, with the Comet Azure. Well, it's probably the same thing as this. Probably the same fucking thing. What do we got? Alright. Oh, yep. Yep. Yeah, it's a tree sentinel. This fucking guy. Yeah, we're not doing that. That guy decided to uh, take him on, but I'm not gonna... I'm gonna try and get by him. But we don't need to fight right now. I don't have any strife with you, my friend. Uh, alright. Alright, let's see what this is all about. He's gonna try and hit me through the fucking... ...mist. Oh... This can't be the last boss. What, we don't get like a really cool cinematic? That... Okay. There's no way I'm beating him on my, on my first try. There's just no way, so... But maybe. You never know. I do have my uh, Mimic tier. Let me give that a try. Help me out. Oh, shit. Get up and help me. Target him. Oh! 
Great. Yeah, you take him on the right, I'll take him on the left. Hit him. Oh my god. Can't even get close to it. Are we done? <laughs> This could be it. This could be the final battle. Oh, yeah. Oh, boy. Yeah, you're a badass. I see it. We're fucked. You got a fresh mimic here? No. Ah. Yep. Oh, we knew that was going to happen. I wonder if it would behoove me to save my Mimic Tier guy until that second phase. Because by then, he's pretty much dead. If I can somehow manage to get this guy down to half health, and then uh, in his second form, use Mimic Tier... That might be good, but I don't know if I can if I can do it on my own. That's the thing. We're gonna take um, a few trial runs at this, and I'm sure it's gonna come to a point where I need help, and I'm gonna go online and look at a video and see the easiest, cheapest way to beat him. But for the moment, I'm just gonna keep at it. I'm gonna try a few different things and see if I can save Mimic Tier to the end. Or whatever, the second phase. Try. Fuck! This is like... So fucking annoying. He's just constantly attacking. Ah! A few times... I've ever been in a situation or ever faced a game at a moment in a game where I couldn't do it. I always find a way. And that's why doing this, beating a Souls game, is just a rite of passage. I'm trying to figure out when there would be a good opportunity to try to get him. 
When can I start my attack? See? I'm trying to target him! Stay alive just a little bit longer, man. We're close. Oh, no. Ah. Oh, my God. What? What the fuck? Why don't I have a sword? What the f Dude, what just what the fuck just happened? What just fucking In my confusion I must have unequipped my sword. And then I'm down. I'm laying on the ground. I'm trying to get up, so I'm pressing the button, and nothing's happening. Right? He's so close to being dead, and I'm so close to being dead, and it's panic. Panic mode. And I'm thinking, maybe, is this part of the game? Like, does he... Did he cast some spell or something that removes my weapon? So maybe I... I maybe this is supposed to happen. So I'm now trying to attack him barehanded. Nope, that's not it, man. I I was this fucking close. This close. And I had to do some dumb shit. Like I always do. Some dumb shit. Yeah. This can't be real. This can't be real. This can't be happening. That, that didn't just happen. I'm not doing this... I'm not doing this shit, like, for the video, for the sake of, like, entertainment. That actually fucking happened. I actually fucking did that. And, yeah. Yeah, it's believable because it's me. Because it's me. It's me, guys. You know? <laughs> well, all right. All right. So it's possible then. It's it's possible. It, it, it could be done. And it will be done. Tomorrow. All right. Here we go. It's night five now, six. Something like that. Um, last time I fought him, I came very, very close to finishing. I believe this is the final boss. Got him down to about just this much health, just a sliver of life. And of course, well, there was a little mishap there, as you probably saw. And uh, couldn't quite do it. Couldn't quite finish, of course. So I'm going to give it another go. And hopefully I can beat him this time. And I believe this is the final boss. I'm not 100% sure. I still haven't like gone online to look up, like, you know, who the final boss is. I kind of want it to be a surprise. For me, anyway, um, I do think, I feel like this could be it. Um, but we'll see. 
And so for anyone that's made it this far watching the video, I really appreciate your support. Anyone that has watched all this way and continues to watch, uh, thank you so much. You know, I love you guys, everyone that supports me and, you know, encourages me to do this stuff. So I hope you've enjoyed it. And for those of you who may be new to the channel, maybe love Elden Ring and wanted to watch some random guy get frustrated, you know, uh, thank you so much for watching and please, you know, subscribe, like the video, turn the notification bell on and all that good stuff. So that way you're notified, you know, whenever I drop a video every couple months or so, you know, uh, hopefully I can start cranking some more out soon. I know it's been about a month since um, my last video, but, uh, you know, this one ran long because of Diablo 4 and I got hooked into some other shit. So anyway, that'll do it for this opening monologue on my hopefully final attempt. Uh, let's give it a go. Let's, um, I'm gonna do my best and we'll we'll see i i got very close last time i feel like i can do this and it shouldn't be uh impossible it's just gonna take a bunch of attempts but i'm feeling good so let's do it let's go I'm looking up shit online like, oh, easy ways to, you know, beat him without being completely cheesy, you know? I'm not trying to completely cheese this guy. Use Rot Breath. Rot Breath doesn't do anything to him. It's not... Even if I can land it, it doesn't, like, chip away at his health or anything. It's not doing anything. I don't understand. Use Rot Breath. Yeah, that, that works real well. Real fucking well. It takes forever to fucking spew it out. And even if I get some clean shots in with it, it doesn't... It doesn't work. He's going berserk. How am I supposed to get this off? Okay. Target him! Okay, it's doing a little bit of damage. All right, here we go. It's chipping away. All right, all right. Yeah. Oh, this is exciting, huh? <laughs> this is a really, like, a really cool way to beat him. But it's working. I just want to beat this fucking guy and be done with this shit, man. No, 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 no. What a fucking joke, man. We're doing this. I'm doing this. I, I don't care. I don't care how many attempts it takes. I am stubborn and that is how I prevail. In situations like this, my fucking stubbornness will see it through. Fuck this guy, man. He's not that hard. I have fought worse. I have beat harder enemies than this. You're nothing, dude. You're nothing. I know there are so many different ways that this can be done, but I'm not trying to figure all that out. I'm just going to do what's working right now. I'm sure there's a whole bunch of different ways, poisoning and all kinds of shit you can probably do to get this guy. Yeah, I'm, I'm back here. Come and get me. Right in the middle of my heel. Oh, 
no, no, no. Stop it! to get him once. I got him! Here it is! Here we go! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hit him with that shit. you I got you we did it oh yeah Woo! we did it guys we did it is this it that was that was so pathetic. I know. I should have should have done it the right way, but the time comes when it's just you just got to do whatever whatever it takes. Winning is winning, man. Winning is winning. Is there another boss? Was that it? Unbound. This is it. We did it, guys. I beat Elden Ring. By this dark fate. But the flames will also burn the impenetrable thorn. Wow. You'll be Elden Lord yet. Man, what a trip. What a journey. What an experience this whole thing has been. The only thing I regret about my uh the only thing I regret about this whole thing is I really should have played this game and lived and breathed Elden Ring. Like, I should have made that, like, my thing. Like, I'm doing with Diablo right now. Like, I play that game every day. I should have done that with this game. I really, I could have been, I could have gotten so much better at this game, man. There's so much that I don't know and that I don't understand. What is this, though? What are we doing? We're... Okay. Well, this is pretty cool. Um... I gotta say that was a bit anticlimactic, though. After everything that you go through in this game, after just everything, the trials and tribulations, the extremely difficult boss battles, and some just really tough moments, and to, to go through all of that, and to do everything that you do to get to the very end, and obviously I, just, just in the way I fought him by using the rot breath and, and everything, that was pretty... Uh, pretty underwhelming way to beat him but it, it's just I don't know that quick cutscene that that you get and 
Um, there's no end credits or anything. It just kind of you just kind of land here, in a very cool area for sure. It's, it's very very cool, but um, definitely a bit underwhelming, a bit anticlimactic, given uh, what you go through in this game. You know, to to complete it and everything. Um, uh, yeah. Uh, we're not done. I'm not done. I thought I, I thought I was done. I thought that was it. That's not it. We're not done. I'm like, yeah, this is a pretty underwhelming, uh, anticlimactic moment here, and we're not done. After de defeating Malaketh, the Black Blade, and Elden Ring, you'll respawn in Lindell, Ashen Capital, and can proceed to the foot of the Erd Tree. You can head southwest through the ash dunes and ruined buildings until you reach an elevator. From there, you can follow the path, but you'll need to defeat several bosses along the way, including Sir Gideon Ofner, the All-Knowing, Godfrey, First Elden Lord, Radagon of the Golden Order, and the Elden Beast. I thought that was it. I thought that was... I thought that was it. Uh, uh, we're not done. I'm not done. No. No. Uh, what to do? Do I make this a two-parter? Because that's going to take forever, dude. Oh, shit. Do I make this a two-parter? Um... If I make it a two-parter... I'll never fucking do it! I'll never finish! Jesus. Jesus Christ! <laughs> okay we're gonna do this in two parts we're gonna make it a two-part episode because yeah yeah i just i can't man i gotta i gotta get this fucking video out like this this is um i gotta try and move on to something else and shit Wow. Wow. All right. So can I finish Elden Ring? Can I finally finish Elden Ring? Not today. Not now. Not on this video. Because there's just... There's no way, man. There's no way. Not not, not currently. Um, I mean, can I do it? Yeah, probably. I mean, I probably will, but... This video is already going to be a fucking two-hour-long thing. And... No one's gonna fucking watch, <laughs> watch it anyway. So uh, I'm actually, I'm actually happy about this. I'm glad because I am really enjoying this game, and I don't want it to end. And I was saying that earlier, like this is kind of depressing. Like this kind of bums me out a little bit because I'm really enjoying this game. Like it's just a great game, and I don't want it to end. The Elden Ring DLC. Uh, uh, I just know how hard it is and how frustrating it's going to be and, you know, people seem to like it but not love it, like, you know, the core game, uh, the core gameplay experience, so, yeah, we're going to make this a two-part episode, guys, and after I complete the list of videos that, um, you know what I mean, I, I've got a docket of videos that I got to, I got to try to attempt doing, so, um, yeah, this has been great, this has been really cool. I hope you guys have enjoyed my my uh, attempt at trying to finish the game, and you know, I'll come back to this. I will wrap this up. I will. I will finish uh, in the next next episode, next time on DDG Unleashed Season X. Dave will finish Elden Ring, but for for now, uh, I think that's gonna do it. You know, yeah, yeah. Um, final thoughts. Before I move on, you know, I always wanted to do some kind of video on Elden Ring, and I didn't want this to be a let's play, you know, 
it's kind of really what it turned out to be, but I like to think I do Let's Plays better than most, because I actually try. And um, I know my my skills in this game are just atrocious, and they're, they're not very good. Um, I'm kind of kind of disgusted with my skill in this game. Like, I pride myself on being really good at every genre that I like to play, and I'm just not very good at this game. But I like to attribute, attribute that to the fact that I don't focus, like, purely on Elden Ring. I feel like if I just played Elden Ring, just really immerse myself in it and played it every day, like, I'd, I'd get to a point where I'd be, you know, satisfied at least with my, my skills. But I'm just... It's just not great, but, um... Yeah, that's gonna do it, guys. That's gonna do it for this one. Elden Ring is a fucking gem of a game. It is so, so good. Just the lore of Elden Ring, the the world in which that they've created from Soft just did a fantastic, fantastic job with this one. I know the other Dark Souls games are really good, too, and I haven't really played them... Uh, at all, you know, I, I've played uh, Dark Souls Remastered a bunch and didn't get like all the way through that. I kind of gave up at some point, but um, I do have Sekiro Shadows Die twice and I've played that a bunch and that's a great game too. Uh, FromSoft is one of the best in their class, man. They they just do a great job with their games. They put a lot of, lot of love and, and care and you can see like they just, they really just excellent at what they do I, I i can't i don't know how else to explain it or put it but uh thank you guys so much for watching this video uh this is going to be a two-parter and um i swear absolutely 100 percent, i will do a part two and i will finish this or at least try to and we'll have a resolution on whether or not uh it can be done that i whether or not i can do it but yeah we've got four bosses to go for yep four bosses and it's gonna be an undertaking for sure so this will allow me to play the game maybe do some other things in the interim and then i'm gonna come back and we're gonna give it another go but um as as terrible as this was as shitty as i have played the game i have managed to uh claw my way to this part in the game which is very very close now to finishing it so that's going to do it for this one, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I enjoyed making it. I enjoyed playing it. So thank you so much. Like and subscribe, all that good stuff. And I will work on my next videos now. And hopefully we'll, we'll circle back now. Uh, hopefully we'll be able to circle back to um, finishing Elden Ring. And so that'll do it for this one, guys. We'll be back soon with more videos, more games to play on Double Dragon Gaming. Peace out.